Hello learners today in this video we are going to talk about antiseptics and disinfectants we are going to talk about proflavin's structural feature including its sar proflavin as you all know it is one of the antiseptic disinfectant agent so chlorocresol and chlorozylenol which we have covered in our previous video those were phenolic compounds proflavin now this structure as you can see this middle ring which is nothing but acridine moiety so proflavin is the antiseptic disinfectant agent which contains acridine moiety so the type of questions which are asked in the exam are name the agent or name the antiseptic and disinfectant which contains acridine moiety or directly the iupac name will be asked in the exam like 36 diamino acridine and this from this name you are supposed to write the structure so this type of questions are asked in the exam so now we will see the structural features and sar of proflavin now coming towards the structure in description box you may find this numbering rule video as well as the nomenclature rules video so if you will see the numbering of this structure first so the numbering starts with this point 1 2 3 4 now the second benzene ring because this middle ring as you can see this is pyridine ring so this is another benzene ring so here it will start 5 6 7 8 9 9 and this nitrogen is having 10th position so if you will properly observe this ring now this ring is basically the primary structure that is anthracene 3 benzene ring fusion but in this middle ring this structure contains nitrogen so if you will skip this benzene ring if two rings only you will take into consideration these two ring so this structure will be formed that is quinoline so quinoline as you all know this is a very famous nucleus of anti malarial drugs that is chloroquine so quinoline ring is there middle ring as we have discussed earlier this is pyridine ring which contains nitrogen at the center and the fusion of this quinoline and benzene or pyridine and two benzene leads to acridine moiety that means pyridine ring to which two benzene rings are fused so this is a fused ring structure which is nothing but it is a acridine moiety which contains nitrogen at 10th position so numbering we have already seen now as you can see here at third position there is one nh2 and at sixth position there is one nh2 so this is amine amine group so this is also amine group so it is 3 and 6 the position is third and sixth position so it is 3 6 diamino and this complete fused ring is acridine so the name will become 3 6 diamino acridine now this proflavin majorly acts by showing its mutagenic effect on the dna how it acts as a intercalating agent it intercalates between the nucleic acid base pairs so <coughs> the primary mechanism is it either intercalates by insertion or it either intercalates by deletion that means intercalation means what to enter in between so whatever the nucleic acid base pairs are there in between them they, they get inserted or deleted so insertion and deletion type of intercalation between the nucleic acid base pairs will occur which is not a substitution that means it will not get substituted it will either deletion will occur or insertion will occur so not substitution which is a general mechanism otherwise that means usually intercalation takes place by substitution of nucleic acid base pairs but here this proflavin will act by either insertion or deletion so it induces the double stranded breaks in the dna by intercalation so this was with the proflavin 
as you all know this nh2 nh2 again it is essential for the activity and this complete quinoline and fused benzene so with this we finish with the proflavin structural features thank you